Hello, what's your name? Hi, my name is Courtney Wood. What's your job title, Courtney? Well, I'm a director of a product design company uh, called Bubblegum Stuff. Here's my catalogue. What is it Bubblegum Stuff does? Bubblegum Stuff is a novelty gift company. Uh, we create, it's kind of like toys really, is we make stocking fillers, the kind of product your parents would buy you for Christmas. Thank you. Um, how did you get into this role? Um, I started my career uh, as a product designer. I went to university uh, at Brunel in West London. Uh, and that, at Brunel I met uh, a guy called James who is the brother of Miss Vardy. And that's why I believe I'm uh, speaking to you guys today. So, in the business bubble come stuff, uh, what's, your, what's your role? Um, I, as the owner, I have kind of many hats I have to wear in the business, but one of the main ones is that I am the, the main product designer. So of the product designs you've worked on, which one are you most proud of? Um, I've got a few products here. Um, one of my best selling products is a baby bottle that looks like a space rocket. Um, and I was inspired to come up with this idea as I saw my little nephew when he was two years old. He was drinking his bottle and then he was playing around with it after. And I thought it'd be great if it actually looked like a rocket and he had even more fun with it. Um, so we launched this product at the start of the year, uh, and since then it's become one of our best sellers. Um, another concept and product that I created and designed um, was called Name the Emoji, um, and this one's sold all across the country at the moment. Um, if I open it up, I can show you. It's a set of 56 game cards, uh, and then on each card you have a different phrase. So hold that one up to the camera if you can see. Can yep. you guess one, what that one is? Do you know what that one is, James? Piggy in the middle. Correct, there you go. So you just have the set of emojis and on the back you have the actual answer. There's one more here for you. Can we guess what that one is? Say what you see. Ghost book, ghost story. Correct. Smart guy, aren't you, James? Can you share an example of the steps involved in taking a product from idea to market? Um, I can show you a product uh, that I've recently designed. Uh, this here is a pair of uh, scissors that look like a flamingo. Um, it's a concept that I created myself, so I came up with the idea for the product. Uh, and then from that, I drew the idea on a computer. I then sent that to the factory, um, and they approved uh, that it would be able to be made. And so then we got it 3D printed in the UK. Uh, and then we, I flew over to China uh, and went to the factory, and we actually managed to get the product made. Um, from them, we actually had to organise getting the product uh, sent to the UK uh, and then actually once it's in the UK we sell it to the shops then it actually ends up in the, into the consumer's hands after that. Uh, so this product here, we've done every single part of the process. We come up with the idea, we make it and then we sell it. What's the best thing about being a designer? Um, I think the best thing about being a designer is that you get to be creative. When I was at school, um, I always really enjoyed studying art uh, and doing paintings and being very creative. Um, and so being a designer, I'm not just stuck behind this computer, I actually get to um, actually design, I get to draw, um, and I get to be creative. And I, I enjoy coming to work each day um, and having fun. Um, if it was just doing emails all day, I think I'd get incredibly bored. So for me, I like being a designer. Is I get to be creative in my job, just like when I was at school. 